Looking towards the ocean now. And again, looking up the road where I'm heading next. Now at the beautiful Santa Barbara Mission. See what a beautiful structure that is. They call it the Queen of the Missions because it's the only California mission that has twin towers and some say it's one of the most pretty. You see the San Inez Mountains in the background. Beautiful lawn area. And over there across the street is the Rose Garden. We'll take a look at that later. There's some information. About this wasp station area. I guess this was filled with water and then they dried their clothes and shoes on the exterior walls there. A beautiful view of the mission. Picture of the mission, mass is just getting out. Some of the fine detail. The entrance there. Now we're inside the beautiful mission. See all the beautiful architecture, the windows, very, very old paintings. the mission you can see down to downtown Santa Barbara which is straight ahead, Rose Gardens, various other beautiful areas uh, right from the central mission area. View of the mission. Just a beautiful structure. I'm now across the street at the Santa Barbara Rose Garden and let's take a look at some roses. Here we go. Now remember, this is near the end of November, and we have this kind of weather with this type of beautiful bloomage from flowers. It's just, it's just super. Beautiful roses in here. Orange ones over there, more red ones down this way. Beautiful grass area to throw the frisbee around and just relax. Very bright, bright red roses here. That just super. Little kids there playing around. 
fine view of the Santa Barbara Mission, big cross there in front. Here's the roadway. And the palm trees and mountains in the background. Here's some beautiful Santa Barbara homes. Right there off the main street. See how big they are? Most beautiful homes that I have seen in Santa Barbara. That looks like a miniature castle. Just lovely. Right near the Santa Barbara Mission, so the location is awesome. We'll go take a look at the front of it. So I just love the architecture of this home. Here's this home from a front view, and you can see how nicely landscaped it is, how well prepared, how well presented it is. I'd love to see the inside. Halfway of the home. Very nice stone walls. Very beautiful bushes. Park in the Santa Barbara area. Do a quick zoom in on there. City built this for all the local area kids, and there are a lot of kids here enjoying the nice weather and the beautiful park. That's Keck Park, and on this rock are some turtles, water turtles. Also in this lake are koi fish. You can see the turtles there swimming. See that? Koi fish are down there somewhere. There's another turtle swimming. There's the koi fish. This is just a beautiful park. This is a lake. Almost set like a Japanese garden. Over oh, there is area. Beautiful trees. Nice area over there. And just gonna say hi. Next stop is the beach. Is, is it is it going recording? Uh huh. Okay. Okay, we can pause. Thanks. You're welcome. How long have you been in Santa Barbara? Well, it's my hometown. Santa Barbara's my hometown. But I moved up to the Northwest seven months ago, and all my friends up in the Northwest, they want to know what this place is all about. You know, a lot of them haven't been here. Yeah. So. I'm down here visiting my parents for the holidays. Okay. What brought you up? Uh, business, really. I'm, uh, I'm working for a Japanese company based out of Tokyo, and they're starting a new operation in Portland. Uh, it's a food service business where they import and export beef, and we also opened a restaurant. So I'm managing the operation for them. Oh, that's good. Yeah.